Hello there, welcome to Disney Parks Addict. Today, we'll be taking a look at all the rides and attractions found at Legoland New York for 2023. Opening in 2021, this is the third and newest Legoland in the US after Legoland California and Legoland Florida. It is located in Goshen, Orange County, which is about 60 miles northwest of New York City and features a Legoland hotel as well as the main Legoland park. As you head through the turnstiles into Legoland New York, you will go straight into the first land, Brick Street. Here is where you can find the big shop, the main merchandise location that is the perfect place to grab a park exclusive Lego set or souvenir at the end of your day. You can also find the Brick Street Cafe for coffee and snacks. The first attraction you will come to in Brick Street is Brick Party, a fun carousel ride that doesn't feature the regular horses. You can choose from a selection of Lego and Duplo creations, including lots of different animals and vehicles, making this perfect for everyone to enjoy. Next door is Rebuild the World, a place for guests of all ages to build, unbuild and rebuild the world of their dreams. Let your imaginations run wild as you help to create a magical wonderland. Also, throughout the day, you can catch the show Bop at the Top in the Brick Street Plaza. For new and old fans of LEGO, you can enjoy a fun show filled with popular LEGO songs. As with all my guides, I will head clockwise around the park, which takes us to the next land, Bricktopia. First up is DJ's Dizzy Disco Spin, a teacup style ride where you can choose to spin until you're completely lost or take it easy and enjoy the ride. With a pumping soundtrack and fun disco lights, this is a great little attraction that everyone can enjoy. Opposite is Build and Test, a place where you can test your different LEGO creations. Build and race your very own LEGO car, test your skyscraper against an earthquake, or see how your models fly through the air, plus many more exciting challenges. Next door, you can increase your brick building skills in the LEGO Creative Workshop. Take a class from a master builder who will share some advanced building techniques. Classes can fill up quick and are on a first come first serve basis, so make sure you head here early to book a spot. Next up is the Duplo Express, a train ride featuring a life-size LEGO Duplo locomotive and models on a fun relaxing looping track. You'll also be able to find the Stepping Tones Fountain. This interactive fountain will play music and shoot water at the various different playpoints. Further into Bricktopia is the LEGO Factory Adventure Ride. This is an awesome trackless dark ride that starts off in the LEGO Factory showing you how LEGO is made before Professor Brick shrinks you into a minifigure and you're shipped out into the real world. This is an impressive attraction and one of the most popular in the park. On the way to the next land, you can find Lego Dots, where you'll be able to create your own masterpiece using Lego Dots tiles and add it to the gallery walls. We now come to Lego Ninjago World, where you will first come to Jay's Gravity Force Trainer. This Himalaya flat ride created by Jay is the perfect training device to get you up to speeds of spin jitsu. It is also home to the awesome dark ride attraction, Lego Ninjago The Ride. This is a 3D interactive ride where you'll be transformed into ninjas and fight against many daring foes. With the use of modern motion tracking technology, you'll only need to use your hands and the ride will track your scores so you can compete against your friends and family or ride again and try to beat your previous scores. Before riding this attraction, there are a number of different exciting challenges including a rock climbing wall and other fun tasks in the Ninja Training Camp. This will help you prepare to become a Ninja Master. You can check out all the LEGO animals and statues on the LEGO Friends Nature Trail, which will lead you to the next land, LEGO Castle. Along the way, you'll notice the LEGO Land Theatre that runs different exciting shows seasonally. You will first come to the Nature Maze, where you'll need to find a way through the tricky hedge maze as you come face to face with lots of LEGO surprises. Next up is Merlin's Flying Machines, a pedal powered spinning machine that with the help of Merlin sends its riders into the sky as you pedal faster or you can simply take a relaxing ride closer to the ground. Nearby is the Tower Climb Tournament where you will need to work hard to compete and hoist up the tower before enjoying a relaxing free fall back to earth. You can join the Builders Guild to help fellow master builders to fortify the castle for the king. For the thrill seekers, you can ride the awesome steel family coaster called the Dragon. You begin this ride inside the enchanted Lego castle before bursting outside aboard the beautiful green dragon. Everyone will enjoy this awesome roller coaster. 
And if you're still not quite ready for the dragon, you can ride the Dragon's Apprentice, a kiddie coaster themed with baby Lego dragons and runs along a fun and relaxing track. If you're enjoying the guide so far, don't forget to hit the like button as it helps us to spread the video to new viewers. We now move on to one of the biggest lands in the park, Lego City. Let the kids become grown-ups with all the fun activities it has to offer. First up is Driving School, where younger riders can transform into a police officer, firefighter, taxi driver or a citizen of Lego City and traverse the many roads on this exciting course. It's open to children between the ages of 6 and 13 and you can even get your very own Legoland driving license in the nearby store. And even younger riders that are between 3 and 5 can also join in the fun at the Junior Driving School, a miniature version of the previous attraction. The next attraction in Lego City is Coast Guard Academy, where you will have the chance to captain your very own Lego themed boat and test your navigating skills on the calm waters of the Lego City Lake. Along the lakeside is the wharf, where younger guests can climb, explore and play above or below deck on this fun theme outdoor playground. You can also find the Palace Theatre that plays a rotation of awesome 4D films that includes the Lego Movie, A New Adventure, Mythica and other popular Lego franchises. Make sure you grab a map as you enter the park for all the up-to-date showtimes. Next door is the Duplo Baby Care and First Aid Center that also includes some quiet rooms for those that need it. Further into the land is the Fire Academy. You and your team will need to take control of a fire truck as you race to put out the fire in this fun competitive team attraction that is great for all the family. For an extra fee, you can also enjoy the city games, remote control cars and the Lego Build a Boat activity. Also opening this year in May is the brand new Water Playground. Located between Lego City and our next land Lego Pirates, this will be a great place for you to cool off this summer. It will include water slides, pirates and plenty of interactive water features. Sticking with the water theme, Lego Pirates includes some great dining options and some awesome attractions. First up is Anchors Away, a pirate ship that can spin in both directions while swaying along the U-shaped track. Luckily, this attraction is not water-based, so it can be enjoyed throughout the year. Next, you can head to Splash Battle, where you will need to navigate through pirate-infested waters. You will get wet on this attraction, as each seat comes with its own water cannon, which allows you to shoot at the various targets along the way, as well as the other ships. Non-riders can also take part by using the various cannons that surround this fun attraction. Nearby, young pirates can climb aboard a fun play ship in Shiver Me Bricks, a fully supervised playground perfect for three to six year olds. And finally, Rogue Riders is a fun jet ski ride where you'll need to steer your vessel to dodge the various water cannons and also try to splash other riders. Again, non-riders can also take part by controlling the different water cannons surrounding the ride. It is now time to move on to the final land in this guide and no Legoland will be complete without a mini land. Filled with lots of amazing replicas of popular American and New York State attractions, you'll be able to find the Bronx and Midtown alongside major cities like Las Vegas and other popular locations from the east and west coasts. Over 20 million bricks were used to create all these models that are filled with so much detail and it's great fun to look for all the hidden easter eggs throughout this awesome land. This area is centrally based and can be accessed by most of the lands in the park as well as leading you from Lego Pirates back to the front of the park in Brick Street. As Legoland New York is over an hour away from New York City, you are able to buy a special ticket that includes a return coach journey from Midtown Manhattan to the resort. Check out Undercover Tourist for some great deals on this ticket as well as regular general admission tickets for Legoland New York. Take a look at my affiliate link below to see how much you can save. I hope you enjoyed this video and consider subscribing as we continue to make more attraction guides for theme parks all over the world. Check out this video for Legoland Florida and I'll see you next time on Disney Parks Addict.